Hello everybody, uh, today's uh, exciting day, uh, today uh, I'm going to be showing the new room configuration, uh, it's a new room, so we're going to have new phones of course, and new phone configuration, so here we got a Polycom VVX 311, and moving down the line, we've got, just did a little sneak peek, we got an AT&T that's just on whatever this freaking piece of junk is um on mpst and just on that voip adapter then we, we have an m2616 meridian one telephone it's got buttons i bought this one it's a 1998 release uh release number two it's a two second release uh there's where that phone can plug into that's got poe on it that's gonna be moved um, that jack is not used at the moment. That will be for Ethernet and for digital. And in the closet, this is where the PBX and termination will be. There's a telephone. And up here we have the TOA. Uh, BG120, 1120. A Netgear piece of junk. <laughs> Netgear hub that is 10 megabit. Uh, base T. <laughs> I just have it come up there. It's not plugged in either. Uh, wires. The Bogan UTI 1. Uh, I don't know if I made a video on that. It's bigger up there. And stack of speakers. 66 block. Pile of junk. And this phone is going to go. It's going to go over here. By the bedside. This phone's getting shipped out to a friend of mine. You guys might know him. High Smart Labs. There you go. I gotta get that shipped out for you. And then the old dreadful closet. Had a lot of fun times here. Uh, the BCM is no longer here. It is actually no longer at this residence. It is at a different location. Still doing great. Works just fine. But yes, um, that's basically it. Um, let me get back to the other room. Yes, so the brains behind this system is going to be a Nortel Option 11. I am going to have to get a, that it, it's getting pulled down for me. I'm going to have to get a SSC for it because it is a succession cabinet, but I'm going to have to get the SSC for it. Um, then it's all going to be programmed with a terminal so through serial and it's a bit a lot more complicated than just plug and playing with like the North Star phones because you gotta you can't just do like feature star three and program a button to do whatever. See there is no feature button and the hold and release button is different. That's a message waiting indicator. But you have all these buttons that can be programmed to do different things. Uh, there is no paging, but you can program trunks to be paging, so I could have a button, like, let's say right there, that could open up a trunk and can be used for paging. Uh, now, the difference between a PBX and a KSC, this is a PBX phone, not a key system phone. Um, even though there's still a bunch of keys, um, if you can look up the difference between a, a key system and a PBX, but this is a PBX phone. So, they're all going to be on the Nortel Option 11. Uh, I have not got that yet, but I do have it, but I don't have it. It's just not been pulled down for me. I'm gonna hopefully be doing that here soon. But yes, I'm running out of storage. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, the little update, and I will be seeing you guys later on. So please subscribe, and I will let you guys know when I get the new system up. Thanks for watching.